and welcome back to this week on Stadia. That's right, summer is here and we have lots of games on discount. So before we begin, like, subscribe, hit the notification button and help this channel grow and let's check out what's in store for us for the summer. Yeah, it's fantastic. Definitely cool. We see some Phoenix Point with Rainbow Six. We got Ark Survive. Uh, Ark Survive. We got Ark. Day by Daylight and many, many, many goody, goody, good stuff. Alright, so da, da, da. let's start off with try new games with only a click away. That's right. If you're on the fence on Stadia, this is the best time to get in because we have lots of games for you on time trial it's not even demo it's time trial which is fantastic we have assassin creed valhalla far cry 6 far cry primal outriders golf with your friends lake delivers to the uh that de uh, suddenly my speech just go crazy deliver us the moon the falconer lumo through the darkness of time and death run tv that's actually a very very nice list especially the assassin creed that's nice i love it all right squad up rainbow six siege year seven season two it's live for people who plays rainbow six siege nice 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 uh you can play uh, yeah you can play without spending a dime oh it's not even on the list here as well nice i like it experience vikings or something about Okay, we got Discovery Tour, which is nice. One of the Ubisoft thing that they have done lately for the Assassin's Creed series, they have this uh, ancient, not say ancient tour. They have this Discovery Tour, especially Egypt, and we have Greece, and then we have uh, now we have the Viking, the Norse, uh, Norse, blah, 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 blah. ah, basically the place in the Viking Age from Assassin's Creed Valhalla. And the 9th to 11th century Northern Europe. No, cool, 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 cool. Um, yep. Oh, nice. It's a little bit cheap. I mean, this uh, Ubisoft Plus subscription, that one went up in price. A little bit sad. 20 US dollars. Uh, yeah. uh, you will be able to play Assassin's Creed Origins at additional cost again. Fantastic. You, uh, I'm not saying Ubisoft Stadia has been putting up very quality weekend gaming session for people who are on the fence. And it's something like this, and I think it's fantastic, right? Play games for free. And 16 to 20th, that's definitely the weekend. Explore co hostile Nos. Alright, Ark Survivor official community map. Nice. Day by daylight, Roots of the Dead chapter now available. Great. Phoenix Point patch now live. Alright, cool. So we have a lot of goody good stuff, updates and whatnot. And the best part is it's the summer sale, and that's what makes things awesome especially this particular news because if you're on the fence again you can play games for free uh, limited time trial and on top of that weekends and then at the same time if you like it you can pick up some of these games and we have some goody good games that is awesome on stadia and let's start off with let's see what do we have here new release okay great they should have i remember they have a page that we got trials that's right so these are the trial page, eh, trial page, two hours for Assassin's Creed Valhalla. We have 60 minutes for Blaze and the Monster Machines, Excel, uh, Excel City Racer, City Skylines for 60 minutes, Death Run TV, half an hour, uh, Delivers the Moon, 30 minutes, Dragon Quest, 100, oh, two hours, nice, Far Cry 6, two hours, great, Far Cry Primal, 60 minutes, yeah, no, you know what, that's a lot of lists, look at, look at the list here right now. Lots of lots of World War Z, yeah, cool outright. There's no GP. Sally, there's no cyberpunk inside here. I wish they have it, but you know what? Beggars can't be choosers. So let's start off with what is on sale, and that's the most important. But we have lots of good stuff. So obviously, I'm gonna make this thing short, simple, and sweet, and I'm just gonna say my top picks, and that's about it. Of course, we have lots of Assassin's Creed Valhalla, yay! Stay the Ultimate Edition, one of my top picks. Sadly, it's not 60 FPS. That's the only disclaimer that I have to put out. Deluxe Gold, I think Gold gets you the Season Pass, $26, 65% discount, nice, very, very nice. That Do note the price here on Pro is in Canadian dollars, that's why the CA over here, and price over here is without the Pro subscription. And if you have a lot of games that you want to buy, I highly recommend get a pro subscription and then get some games, which is highly recommended. All right, Assassin's Creed Origin Gold Edition, it's nice, but mm, yeah, no. 
I would recommend that. And then we have Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Obviously, I would choose the uh, Ragnarok edition. This out, or you can choose the complete edition, right? Forty dollar, uh, forty, forty percent off. Uh, I'm gonna say forty dollars. Then Borderlands, not bad. Seventy five percent off. Great, All right? You get ultimate edition or deluxe. You get everything. That's that. All right, Child of Light, nice. Chorus, nice. Cyberpunk, fifty percent off. That's nice. Dead by Daylight, right? Lots of Dead by Daylight stuff. Let it load a little bit. Okay, let's see. Destroy our humans. Interesting. Dirt 5, 73% off. Okay, it's year one year one edition. What's the difference between these two? 75% off. Yeah, obviously I'll take that 75% off. Easy. Doom, nice. We have Doom as well. Dragon Ball Xenoverse. I'm waiting for Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. There we go. We have it. Ultimate edition. Awesome. 60% off. Nice. Uh, sadly, this one doesn't have pro discount, so you can get this without having pro subscription. Yeah. Far Cry 5, okay. Personally, I would recommend Far Cry 6. Easy, easy Far Cry 6. The only thing for me, this is my pet peeve, is this it's not 60 FPS, that's why I won't pick it up yet. But it is an easy pick for me, for sure. Final Fantasy 15, easy pick, for sure. 50% off, interesting. Uh, Immortal Phoenix Rising, very nice, especially the... Do we have Stadia? There we go. Gold Edition Stadia. What's the difference? I remember there's a Stadia Edition for this, but I might be wrong. Hmm. Alright, cool. We got the Season Pass. That's the most important thing. Next, Judgment. Actually, not bad. Not bad. Judgment is up there. Kona, Lara Croft, alright. Most of the Lara Croft. Madden. Stair, Marvel Avengers, pick the normal one, end game edition gets you skin and I don't think you need skin, no expansion for Marvel Avengers yet, a bit sad. Uh, Metro Exodus, gold edition, highly recommend, right? highly recommended, there's, uh, I think there's some stories, extra stories, let's see, let's see, let's see, yeah, we got two stories over there, it's nice, the, the, the game is very nice, the story is very compelling, I, I love that game. Next, Octopath Traveler, very nice JRPG game. Outward, okay, that's interesting. PGA Tour, Rage 2, this is a very underrated uh, shooter from soft, uh, ID Software. Eat, eat Software. Yeah, this is a very underrated game, right? From the makers of Doom. So, Rage 2 Deluxe Edition, not bad. And uh, 20 Canadian dollars, that's decent. Rainbow Six Siege, okay, this one's a bit so-so. Rayman Legends, very nice. And of course, I will always recommend Red Dead Redemption 2. This is one of the games that really push the power of cloud gaming for Stadia. And it's fantastic, fantastic. Same goes with Resident Evil, but Resident Evil, it's a little bit, I'll say slower, shorter, but it's nice, right? It's nice, but being a Resident Evil game, actually, it is very, very good. Riders Republic, very good as well. Uh, Tomb Raider, easy, recommended. Remastered, okay, remastered a bit hard. If it's remake, then there'll be a different story. Scott Pilgrim, my, one of my guilty pleasure game. Sekiro Shadow Die Twice, this is a very hard, uh, not say discount, hard to get game on Stadia with discount. So if you've been missing out 50%, it's still there. I think it's still good, still good. Jedi Fallen Order, one of my highest pick for Stadia as well. Very, very nice. The Division 2, okay, that's decent. It's old game, right? Some of these Tom Clancy's are old, very, very old. Ghost Recon Wildland, okay, great, great, great. Falcon Chronicles, nice. Watch Dog Legion, huh. nice, nice, nice. A lot of Ubisoft games here. And I think that's what OWW 2K better got. Okay, doesn't have the new one. I, I was hoping that it's a new WWE for Stadia. Well, that's all. Looks like that's it. Hmm. So we have a few good games over here, right? Well, top pick is always Red Dead Redemption 2, followed by Cyberpunk, followed by Assassin's Creed Valhalla. And one or two more odd picks. Far Cry 6 is definitely up there as well. Doom, definitely a showcase game for Stadia as well. And that's all. That's all I have for you for today. I know it's simple, short, and sweet. Yeah, definitely. Kakarot is actually, actually Dragon Ball Z is a very nice game, right? So many, so many games. Lots of indie games as well, and it's uh, it's fantastic, fantastic. Actually, Elder Scroll, Elder Scroll eats life. I mean, eats my time a lot. <laughs> eats life. Yeah, my life. 
Ugh, humankind. Love this game. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Alright, that's it. That's all I have for you for today. So like, subscribe, hit the notification button and help this channel grow. Until then, I'll see you guys in the next Stadia update. And best of all, have fun and go shopping. Yep, yep, yep. It is definitely awesome. Until then, see ya, my friends.